It is freaking cold out here, and I just boiled water by harnessing the power of the sun. You can have sterilized drinking water in just a couple hours from virtually any water source using just the power of the sun. Check this out, guys. Boiled, sterilized water. But will it make hot chocolate on a freezing cold day? You better believe it will, Gramps. Holy smackerels, I think I just burned my whiskers. What are you waiting for? My code for your massive discount for the Patriot Sun Cooker is in the description below. Something's got to change. I don't care what people think anymore about me or what I wear or what they say about me. It doesn't matter. The only thing that you should care about is the homeland, the country, where you come from, where you live at. Making it better. Do not tolerate government, uh, government oppression. Fight this, fight this, fight this. Um, back. This it's David Lowe, and welcome to the greatest shit show on earth! Fight like a sheep. Okay, yesterday I featured this guy on the channel. Didn't know his name then, but I do know it now. His name is David Lowe, and he's an activist in his town in Washington who actually gives a damn about pushing back against tyranny as he tries in his own way to wake people up. His mockery-style activism serves to not only confront masked Kool-Aid drinkers and make them look into the mirror at their own foolish actions as they sleepwalk through life believing the counterfeit news network, it also provides some much-needed comic relief. The unflinching spirit of freedom is resistance, and the heart of maintaining that freedom is rebellion. There are so many people asking who this guy is and requesting to see him a second time, I thought I'd go ahead and feature him again. I'll leave the link to his Facebook page in the description and in the pinned comment. They heard his meh. What are you doing today to make a difference in your community? What are you doing today to wake up Americans in your world? What are you actually doing? What are you doing really to make a difference in your community? Are you out there protesting? Are you making a difference? Got to go get some Benadryl today and uh, the sheep show continues to move forward here in the streets of America in my hometown. Welcome to the greatest shit show on earth. It's David Lowe. The stream seems clear. More propaganda and lies. I'm the killer of propaganda and lies. Are you waking people up? What are you doing? What are you doing, everyone? What are you doing today to stop this foreign takeover that is going on? I don't support what's going on, but there are businesses in my community now that are opened and operating behind closed doors of the government. The government has literally made it illegal for you to operate your business and people are putting up with this. They say Walmart can make famous. It's still, the sheep are still wandering. The agenda moves forward, people. Oh man, they got the propaganda glass everywhere. It's a good thing to see a lot of people aren't going along with the hoax anymore, you know. Uh, the, the community has woken up. Uh, oh, there's some sheep grazing in here. They're like, oh my God. We're still up. There's some big sheep moving. They're trying to hide. They're like, there's that guy with the cutout. There's that guy with the cutout. He's waking them up. Waking them up. Start calling your sheriff. Start calling your city council members. Start calling city officials. Call anybody you can to get their phone number, to get information to them that we're in a hoax. Okay, they have to start looking at the research. They have to start looking elsewhere for their information instead of the mainstream media. My favorite channel is CNN. They have the best propaganda and lies. Oh, two sheepers right here, another chapel. They're everywhere. Ha ha. Ha ha. Ha ha, you look like a sheep. I'll be 86 out at every Walmart in the world. They're pushing the agenda to the pharmacy too. Gotta keep the fear going. Got to keep the fear going. Where is the, uh, do you guys have any sheep feed here? I'm trying to find some. It would be back in the pet department. Oh. Look at the absurd news that they're posting about this whole Cove idiot situation. They've got people believing it, and then they got people that aren't believing it, and then they got people that are woke, and then they got people that want to do something about it, but they're not doing anything about it. 
Let's do something. Let's triumph over the government, people. That's what we have to do. Wake them up. Stop, stop spreading those rumors around. Stop, stop spreading the lies. I like that song. Ah, the sheep show. Go graze by some more freaking asshat sheep. It's ridiculous. Oh my god, there's a guy breaking the matrix in the store. He's breaking the whole matrix. The, the whole the whole facade is falling down. People are waking up. Defy these orders. Mob raid by these Home Depots. Show up with 10 people. Give them resistance at the door. Continue giving them resistance. Fill out paperwork and then start putting it inside of their stores that we do not consent. Put it on these Walmarts. Take it with you and write how you feel about Walmart, Home Depots on a message and get a piece of tape or something and then stick it inside of the stores. And, and start letting people know, the other people know, write it on the American money, what you think. Whatever your message is, get it out there. She's wearing a Chappelle mask. The sheep food's in the back. If you're looking for sheep food, they sell sheep food in the back. Oh, wow. Yeah. It's cheap. It's called your brain. Sheep grain. Is that what we should call it? There's a Chappelle over here. In the, oh, I'd like some bananas. Meh. This is an information war, okay? We are on the front lines of this information war. Do something about it as a human, as a person, as someone that doesn't want to have the boot of tyranny on their necks. I love Anderson Cooper, do you? He's great. Bah! Oh, this guy, he watches. Do you watch Anderson Cooper? I love Anderson Cooper. Wake them up. We're all in this together. We're on the right track of overthrowing our government. This is what the Second Amendment is about. Something's got to change. I don't care what people think anymore about me or what I wear or what they say about me. It doesn't matter. The only thing that you should care about is the homeland, the country, where you come from, where you live at. Making it better. Do not tolerate government, uh, government oppression. Fight this, fight this, fight this. There's a grazer right there. Meh. Hey, the sheep food's in the back if you're looking for it, ma'am. There's sheep food in the back. They sell it by the dog food section. Stop, stop spreading those rumors around. Meh. Wake him up. What's the problem going on? I, you're not supposed to pull your stuff up till they actually walk away. Who, who's they? The lady in front of you. And they're just trying to keep uh, everyone's social distancing. Who's they? Well, who? What? We're just trying to keep everyone's social distancing, so we're asking that customers wait till the previous customers all right. paid and well, left. We all know it's a big crock of lies, all right? We just have to follow... Protocol and the, the government's agenda, and basically, uh, it's, a, it's a propaganda routine, you know? I, I get it, and I'm going to continue to resist, and I'm, I'm just done shopping here after this. How much money do I owe? $22.54. All right. Meh. 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 I like Anderson Cooper. They sell good sheep food in the back if you're looking for sheep food. I like that, that's cool. You look nice. Some sheep food over here. Bats, some more sheep. Oh, ooh. Hey ma'am, I suggest you turn off your television. It's all propaganda and lies. People are waking up to the hoax. You should too, do your research. Ma'am, it's all a hoax, wake them up. Your television is propaganda and lies. <laughs> a couple of sheep. There's sheep food in the back. Now well, let's get out of this hoaxville. The propaganda and lies, of, they're everywhere. They're spewing through the media. I should pick up a newspaper so I can shit on it again today. <sighs> oh, nice sheep. Look at that sheep right there. She's got the, the cool... Bah! It's all a hoax. Wake them up. Go spend the fiat. Bah! Here we 
She just touched my hand. Did you see that? And if you guys are going along with it, it's going to destroy the American country. Do you not realize this? Bah! Is my food over there? All right, good deal. You guys have a great day. I will. Bah! Bah! Am I trespass? No. Get a document out and trespass me then. I'm not going to trespass. Bah! Bah! Freaking hoax. Bah! 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 Blow me! I mean, she's wearing a face shield. This is hilarious. Let's get out of this shit show. Ma'am! Ma'am, you look like an idiot. You look like a sheep. Bah! Look at this sheep right here. Ha uh ha. -huh. Your employer shouldn't make you wear that. You look like an idiot. How do we get out of this shit show? I'm leaving. See ya. It's all a hoax. Quit watching your TV. You look like an idiot. And she's like hiding. I don't want to be seen with my sheep show mask on. Look, at there's some more sheep right there, guys. They're freaking everywhere, man. They watch that television and the propaganda and lies. Kill the lies, everybody. Kill the lies. Get the information out there. Fight on the front lines for America. Okay, guys, don't forget to visit David Lowe on Facebook and give him some love. Also, let him know High Impact Vlog sent you. Leave your thoughts about this for the world and the Google Thought Police in the comments section below. Don't forget to subscribe to my private email list through my website, highimpactflix.com. If you want to support more content like this, grab one of these hard-hitting conversation starting shirts from the store. I'll see you guys in the next heavily censored shadow ban video. Deaf and dumb thespians take the silent stages with their cobweb throats. They can't sing any notes, so the audience begins dispersing. The actors get pissed, they start cursing. They're tired of rehearsing. They're ready to do the damn show. They're ready to go. You know what I mean? Fuck the quarantine. Fuck COVID-19. Fuck a fucking vaccine. Social engineering at the center stage. About to go full circle when we turn the page. Miss Deborah Burks, you old bitch, putting COVID on old bits and certificates. It's ridiculous. We, we should be enraged at our rate, at our newfound fate, and change the current state of mind controls. As Mr. Gates pulls the levers of power from his ivory tower, he is a Zionist, a mad scientist. With unlimited funds, we need to run or we need to get some more guns. And we need to do that shit while it's possible, because pretty soon I swear it's not going to be optional. Are you hearing me? The wealthy be stealthy, ushering in this tyranny. I don't want a mask, give me an Uzi. I want